Hey everyone, I'm Olivia Radcliffe and this is an Ebeam Crash Course. Today the Ebeam team is heading to a car dealership to see if they can demonstrate the use of electron beam cross-linking in cars. The big question is, can they make the sale? Let's go check it out. Cross-linking, 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 and some branching. That's how awesome e-beam cross-linking is and the e-beam process is. Here we are at a car and we're going to tell you all the different places cross-linking with e-beam can be used. Let's look under the hood here. So under the hood here we have ductwork that with cross-linking you can get better temperature properties, better creep resistance so it can handle those high temperatures and low temperatures a lot easier. Often it's made out of polyamide. Also under the hood here we have connectors. Connectors that go ahead, again, see high temperatures under the hood, and they need that good connection. Otherwise, you know, if you don't have controls on your car, that would be bad news. If we walk over here, you have here, you have other caps here, you have caps here and here on all these containers, and with all those, there's seals under there. You know, they're often TPE or EPDM. Get those cross-linked, and you can go ahead and have better environmental so it can handle, say, the, the antifreeze or the brake fluid, and it doesn't expand and swell, and that's a great thing. Another benefit of e-beam cross-linking. Okay, so let's check out what's inside the car that can be e-beam cross-linked. Hey guys, this foam here is cross-linked to improve durability and consistency in foaming. This headliner is cross-linked to improve the dampening of the sound, and this material that's on the dash and on the doors it is made of a branch material or cross-link material that improves the mar resistance and is also heat resistant because man it's hot out here but everything in the car is doing great it's not even sweating so it's not just about what's inside the car or under the hood it's also about the tires themselves because they all have seen electron beam cross-linking to go ahead and add strength to build a fantastic tire i think that's just about it and don't forget about the cross-link jacket on the brake control cables. There you have it, folks. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time.